as she knows, and I'm bringing you messages directly from the words of our 45th president, President Donald John Trump. This is straight from his desk. He says on November 2nd, I'm bringing you up to speed, honey. Early indications are that MAGA voters are turning out big for Glenn Youngkins. Let's see what happens. All eyes on Fairfax. Why the delay? Ha <laughs> ha! Let's move right on along. Yes, honey. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Then our 45th president goes on to say, I would like to thank my base, B A S E, for coming out in force and voting for Glenn Youngkins. Without you, he would not have been close to winning. Mm. Remember, everything our president says is a message he goes on to say the maga movement that's us <laughs> is bigger and stronger than ever before glenn will be a great governor thank you to the people of the commonwealth of virginia and most particularly to our incredible maga voters <laughs> Mm. He's giving you a hint and a hint and a hint. Ah, then he goes on to say, it is looking like Terry McAfliff, capital M-C-A-U-L-I-F-F-E's campaign against a certain person named Trump. <laughs> has very much helped Glenn Youngkins. All Mick did was talk Trump, Trump, Trump. And he lost. Our president goes on to say, what does that tell you? It tells me a whole lot. It tells me that um <laughs> he was bumping his gums <laughs> for nothing. <laughs> and it also tells me what his next two words is. Fake news, fake news. <laughs> Our president, 45, went on to say, I guess people running for office as Democrats won't be doing that too much longer. Hint, hint. I hope y'all catching this. He said, I didn't even have to go rally for Yonkins because McAuley did it for me. <laughs> go Trump, go Trump, go Trump. He goes on to thank you to MAGA voters for turning out big. You welcome. <laughs> now let's move right on along. Aha. Uh -huh. We making America great. I hope y'all see that we is. Um, then our amazing president, number 45, Donald John Trump, says big congratulations to my friend Steve Buvo on his election as mayor of Haley, Florida, Florida, Florida. I hope y'all catching it. He ran a great race. Steve has been a loyal supporter and is a great patriot. He is tough on crime and will always protect our Second Amendment rights. Way to go, Steve. <laughs> you better keep it up. <laughs> Or you might go down. <laughs> mm. He went on to say that supports, uh, Steve also support our American First agenda. Now remember, when I was in Florida, Sarasota, Florida, after rally, the President Trump's rally there, President Trump, there was a, a, a message on a vehicle and y'all, they wiped all my information from all my videos from Florida, but he had on the trunk a statement and in the statement was the word agenda. Go, uh, uh, I was going to say God, mm, maybe Look, it is talking to us. President Trump is talking to us. I'm trying to tell you. Uh, 
he said steve supports our american first agenda you know <laughs> mm. and he knows the value of a strong economy and he understands the evil of socialism so he goes on to thank him and says good luck to steve and i look forward to seeing you soon So there's something in here for Mike Carey, but um, let me see where Mikey Carey at. Uh, let's put you down at the bottom. So our president says, congratulations to Mike Carey on a fantastic victory in Ohio. He says, I'm very proud to have endorsed him early and strongly. He will be a great congressman. Y'all better catch all of this tea, honey. Y'all better catch the tea. He goes on to say on November 3rd, 2021, if there was no Trump in this election, there would be no Glenn Youngkins. John Fredericks, the John Frederick Show. Hint, hint. 11 3 20, 21. I'm telling you, this man is talking to us if he ain't never talked to us before. Trump sweeps election day. Goes 4 0. <laughs> Thank you. Very much to Paul Dendart. We'll 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 come back to that because that was pretty large. Um, something to read. So, um, let me continue to bring you on up to speed. Turn out in Virginia governor's race. So that's on the fourth. And there's a whole chart of uh, successful congratulations, et cetera, for the governor's race in Virginia. It's a good thing, good thing, good thing. And so here we are on today. Actually, yesterday. He'll be tweeting and uh, uh, sending something else to his dad. Our president on November 5th, 2021, this is the statement by Donald J. Trump, the 45th president of the United States of America, our duly elected king that God has appointed to run this race and get this <laughs> whole situation of his creation back intact. He goes on to say that the Democrat politicians of this country spent 99 percent of their time fighting republicans that's me and you and no time thinking about making our country great if they would spend half of that energy fighting china 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 russia iran and even the european unions now guys he said those in order. I hope y'all listen. He said China, Russia, Iran, and even the European Union, where the United States just dropped. Y'all hear that aircraft? It's a big one. Where the United States just dropped all tariffs. We would go back to the greatest again. They are weak with everybody except conservatives. Our country has become the laughing stock of the world. Guys, I have brought you up to speed and up to current as of November 5th, 2021 from the Death of 
the 45th president of the United States, still standing, horny. Never conceded, horny. God ain't compromised, so why would he? And why would we? So continue standing with him, praying for them and him. Them meaning the special op, JFK, JFK Jr., the husbands, the wives, the sons, the daughters, the grandkids, and this great America. Until we come back on and meet again right here on 45 Trump News, which they suspended my whole channel. The whole, my whole, all of my channels are on YouTube. Yeah, I can't do nothing on my laptop with it. It says you're suspended off Google <laughs> for violation. <laughs> but um, I'm still able to do it on my phone. Thank you, Jesus. But until we meet again to speak about statements from our duly elected 1945 President Donald John Trump. I say, ride on King Jesus, no man can I hinder me. Ah, they show game. <laughs>